Hello and welcome back to another video. So the new promo is here, is foot headliners. Um, I'll put the screen up on the team for the moment, or oh, in a minute, but um, what we're going to do is just go and have a look through what SBCs are out, um, what objectives, oh there you go. So, okay, I won't look here too much into that yet because we'll go and have a look in a minute, but um, weekly objectives, we've got Karem Demir Bay, 85 rated Cam, um, yeah, it doesn't look too bad. Win eight rivals matches with 11 German players. Um, the Lunar New Year kit. Score eight goals using Chinese Super League players. La Liga Santander. Score five goals using La Liga Santander players. Um, win four squad battles matches. What do you get for that? A rare gold pack. Yeah. Uh, Leeds versus Norwich. Okay, so there's, there's another. Win five online singles matches using 11 EFL Championship players. Disallowed leagues. Okay, that that's quite a good, uh, quite a good one for a prime gold players pack. Um, obviously, the new foot swap deals is here for February, so we'll go and have a look at those players. So there's a lot of things coming out. I might do, I don't know. We'll, we'll this is going to be a long video. We're gonna, I might do two videos, um, depending on how long we get to this one. But um, yeah, I'm going to put the team up on the screen now. So we have an amazing set of players here obviously 90 rated Paul Pogba looks really good uh, the 89 Alexandro 88 Sa Sane 88 Werner I see how is that is Werner's Werner's inform is must be an 87 much like Sane's on so it's just sort of like a small upgrade to the players because all I, I have all of these players had informs yeah they have so you've got the t Royce which is a bit strange. Um, Sommer, uh, Sun. You've got that Lala card, 87. So a lot of people are going to want that. That is going to be a very expensive card. You've got the 87 Pepe, 87 Marquinhos, 87 Z actually isn't too bad. Uh, 87 Suso, 87 Skriniar. Now Skriniar's, I'm pretty sure his card, um, the League SBC card is 87 rated. I'm not quite sure. 86 Marcus Rashford. Now that looks like quite a good card. Um, Lozano 86 rated. Dembele 86 rated. 86 Zapata, Sarabia, and Hernandez. So yeah, that, that it, it looks like quite a good team. Um, but let's go and have a look at what um, SBCs we've got and things like that. So let's go to live. Oh, okay. Oh. 87 rated Marco Arnautovic. Okay. There's two slots that need completing for that. We've got a foot 19 headliners challenge as well, which we're going to go and do. Player pick upgrade. One of four rare players. Okay. And a mixed player trick. Right. Why have they bought this back? This is the most biggest waste of time at SBC. I mean, people might have been lucky, got good things from this, but no. I don't think so. So um, let's go and have a look at this headliners challenge first. So yeah, what I'm going to do is I'll probably release two videos today or maybe one tomorrow uh, for the foot swap deals. We'll go through that properly instead of doing that in this video. But um, So we need one Premier League player, pros from the same nation as maximum four, minimum of three leagues. Okay, so players from the same nation as maximum four. So what we can do here is just go... Premier League, I think. Um, let's go low to high. Have what untradeable cards do we have? Okay, less. Mm, oh yeah, yeah. Let, let's use the untradeables. So what was it? Three league. It's minimum of three leagues, and they all need to be gold. Okay, yeah. This should this shouldn't be a problem. So we've got three centre backs in there. I'll try and use as many untradeable players as I can. CDMs. We'll just use CMs for that. Pereira can go in. We'll use the Argentina guy there. And if we've got... A, we'll use a CM for this. So let's just go to centre mid on these. Do you need rare players? No rare players needed. Just exactly gold. So what we'll do for this... Let's go down into these ones and put those two in. And for the cam, I might go and try and use a different league for this, but... If we've got any Argentinian players in the Premier League, that'd be quite nice. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Let's go back on there. Um, 
So we could go to the Argentinian league, I suppose. See if we've got any players from that. We probably haven't. Perfect. He can go in. And then striker. He can go in there. And then we'll use... Didn't mean to do that. Just use a Brazilian striker. What league is he from? So there we go. That's completed that. Really, really easy. Um, like you see, I use quite a lot of untradeable players. So really, really easy, this SBC. And we get a premium gold players pack for this, which isn't too bad at all. Um, so I saved up the packs from rewards yesterday. So we'll be opening them in this video, see if we can pack one of these players. Um, but what we'll do is we'll go and complete what what things we've got here. I might complete marquee matchups as well. But I'll do that off and just show you the teams. Um, so we've got this Marco Arnautovic card. So he's four star, four star, which isn't too bad. High, medium, six foot four as well. With this new crossing thing that everyone keeps using, um, saying this sort of the meta and whatever, a lot of people are going to want this card. So he's got good pace, really good shooting, good passing, good dribbling, and good physical stats. I've got his red card from 84 in form. He's had an 86 rated in form since then. Um, and it is a really good card. It was when I was using it anyway. So what do you need for this? You need an 85 rated, so basically an 85 rated near enough Premier League team. And an 83 rated team with one team of the week. So you get a prime gold players pack for that and a prime electrum players pack for that. So I might do this card. I'm not going to do it today. Um, but while this promo is obviously, I'm guessing it's going to be here for a week. Um, I'm not quite sure. So I've just seen actually some of the best on form players from the first half of the season are now dynamic items that will always stay one in form ahead. Wow. Okay. This is amazing, actually. So if any of these players get in it another inform, this card will always be one ahead of that inform. This is amazing. This is a really, really good promo. Um, so if he got if he got another inform, say he goes up to an eighty-seven, that card will be boosted up to an eighty-eight. These cards are going to be seriously expensive. Um, let's go and do this player pick one as well. What do you need for this? Rare players is minimum six, exactly gold. This shouldn't be too much of an issue. Um, let's go gold. We'll go to untradeable, low to high. What are we going to say now? Don't really want to use um, Serie A players. Let's go for this. I know people are going to say don't use these cards, but they're rares, they're untradeable. I'm not going to use them for anything else. So, why not? Is that all the Serie A players I have? Oh, no, I'm un untradeable, aren't I? <laughs> I was going to say, surely I've got more players than that. Okay, let's just go back here. Yeah, I, I don't really want to use too many of these players, but we'll use them where we can. It wasn't from this yeah, rare player, so we need six rare players. So we've got three there. Let's just take all these guys here. Oh. Let's just go up to the rare players now. I think I've used quite a lot of my rare players. So we've got a few there. Let's see what we can do with this. So put Bakioko in there. We'll use this cater. So you need six rare players. Let me put all those in first. So both of these are untradeable, so I don't mind using those at all. Uh, that Martinez can go up top. And Channel Glue in there. And then... Oh, we only need 50 chemistry for this? Oh, well. It's already happened. I, I'm not going to swap all the players around now. Him in there. And him in there. So I've probably spent way too much, but I use I still haven't sort of recuperated any of my rare players. Um, but we get a rare player pick from this. So player pick upgrade. Whatever that means. One of four rare players. Probably all going to be 75 rated, but you never know. Let's go ahead and open this. 
Wow, that's absolutely dreadful. <laughs> um, see, now I don't know if it's a take Jonas. Obviously, he's going to be untrade. Oh, is he untradeable though? I'm going to take him because um, we can always use him for something else. So there we go. So um, that's a duplicate 84 that we've got on there. So that's not too bad, actually. Uh, but yeah, we'll, we'll probably complete that Arnautovic at some point. Um, so I, I would say West Ham players are now going to go up in price a lot, especially the high-rated ones. I might actually use his card, his red card for that. Um, and we've got this mixed player trader one. I, I'm not going to be doing that just because it's just a bit of a waste of time. Um and that is, oh, so this is repeatable as well. Okay, so that's not too bad. I didn't know that was repeatable. So we could get quite a few good things from that. Um, I might do a couple of them later on. Um, so yeah, marquee matchups. I'm just going to go and build this. Um, I'll probably show you the teams, but just so I can get some more packs and then we'll go into opening the packs to see if we can get one of these cards. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so I've completed all those. So the first one is Barcelona versus Valencia. So we need two Valencia players, which we've got up in the striker and the left mid slash left back. Um, and then we've just gone for Premier League for the rest of it and Vida in there just for another rare player. So really simple. We get a jumbo gold pack for this one, which is quite nice. Yes, I know that, yes. Um, Roma versus Milan. So you need one Roma or one Milan player, three nationalities minimum, exactly gold with 85 chemistry. So I've gone for full Serie A. I've got an untradeable. Um... Oh, he's tradable. What? No. Okay, we'll swap him out. Let's go. I thought he was untradable. Let's put in... We can put in whoever we want here. Oh, I don't want goalkeeper. Let's swap him over. Let's just put... Yeah, let's just put him in. He'll do. Um, so, yeah, really, really, really easy. Really, really simple. We'll put that in for a gold players pack. That's not too bad. And then the next one is going to be Olympic Lyon versus Paris. So you need two French players. Players from the same league as maximum four and four clubs minimum. So this one's a little bit more difficult just because of the formation. But we've got the four French league players up there just to get really good chemistry. Bundesliga down the right hand side, centre back and CDM. And then we've used the nationality to get the goalkeeper and the last two here for just a different league. So again, really, really easy. 85 chemistry is all you need on this. You see a couple of players out of position. So yeah, we'll put that in for a rare gold pack. And then the last one is Zurich versus Basel. So you need two RSL players. So we've gone for to this left wing and the striker and then the rest of this is just Liga Nos. I'm way over the rating but most of these are untradeable so we just thought why not chuck those in um, and we get a small Electrum players pack for this and then for completing the whole thing we get a prime gold players pack which isn't too bad at all um, the only other thing I think yeah so let's go and open the packs See what we can get from here. We've got 15 packs in total. Um, and then what I'll do is I'll probably, yeah, tomorrow's video will probably be for the foot swap deals. Um, we'll have a look through the players that we need, that you can get from that and go from there, really. So let's go, should we just start from front to back? So some of these are going to be untradeable, some are tradable. We'll start off with a small Electrum players pack first. I'm guessing all these cards are going to be walkouts. Saying that, yeah, they will be, won't they? Because I think the smallest one's an 86. So we're getting informed straight away. It's going to be Italian centre-back. So that's not too bad at all. Um, we get an 81-rated centre-back from a small Electrum players pack. That's not too bad at all. Obviously, inform. That is a really nice pack. Um, yeah, we'll put them straight into the club. Um, I doubt he's going to be worth a great deal. 400, no, he can go. Okay, so no, we started off quite well. Um, what else do we have here? So we've got rivals, or we'll leave those until last. We'll start from the front and just carry on going through. Leave all the players' packs. So next, this pack here. Can we get boards? We do get boards. So we get Portuguese goalkeeper. That is going to be Rui Patricio. So that's not too bad. I think he is a duplicate, which is a bit of a shame. Um, but yeah, he is a duplicate. So we'll put him up. 
we'll put him up as well. And if we get if we get to the point where we've got too many duplicates, then I'll get rid of the common cards. Um, so next, we've got two Jumbo Premium Gold Packs. I mean, it would be really nice to pack one of these players. Again, I think it's going to be the same as the other promos. You've just got to open loads and loads and loads of packs. And it's just... I don't know. It's, it's never going to happen, really. I don't think. Uh, we get Dembele there, 75 rated. But, um, yeah, I, hopefully we can get that Arnautovic done because that would be quite a nice card to have. Um, like I say, I've used his 84 rated card, the Inform card that he had. And it was really good. So, so these are untradeable. So these are... Division Rivals Rewards. So we'll just swap all these over. And then... Uh, get rid of him. I doubt he's worth anything, is he? Oh, okay, people are buying him. So we'll sell him for... Put him up for that. See if he sells. It's next for 300 coins. And we'll put both of those up. So next is a Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. So we've got 12 packs left. It'd be nice to get a walkout from one of these, just a normal walkout, really. I, I don't expect to get one of these cards at all, but obviously it'd be really nice to get one because they are going to be worth a hell of a lot, I would have thought, even the lower-rated ones. Unless we get an untradeable one, which would be a bit of a shame. But So, Vanekin there, not a lot else, really. That's not a great pack. Uh, so, let's just swap all these over. Oh, God, come on. And then we'll get rid of those and send him up. So next pack, we've got a gold players pack. Can we get something from this? Probably not. One rare player. I doubt it's going to be very good. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just... If they're not boards or anything, then I'll just skip the pack. I'm not... Uh, I don't want to take up too much time in this video, really. Um, yeah, that's not a bad pack, I suppose. Like I said, these are tradable anyway, so... Not too bad. So we've got two prime gold players... Oh, well, a premium gold players pack, a prime gold players pack. So I think the premium premium gold players pack might be... Was that from uh, the marquee matchups? I'm not sure now. So it's boards on this one. we got a Spanish striker. It's going to be Adaris. 83 rated. Mm. Not great. Oh, yeah, that's a pretty poor pack, to be honest with you. Yeah, so this is tradable. Um, I'm going to get, I think, Prime Gold Players Pack. I think this is untradable. Oh, no, it's from the Marky Matchup. Sorry. So, no walkout again. Are we going to get a boards in this one? No. Not good at all, really. Um, yeah, that's not a great pack either. So, we'll uh, send those up. So we've got two rare gold packs, two rare player packs, two mega packs, and two rare mega packs. So left all the packs, all these good packs to the last. Um, I think the rare gold pack, I can't even remember what's untradeable and tradeable in this now. So it's a walkout. So just a normal walkout, which is a shame. Um, who is that? Oblak? Oh no, Handanovic. That's nice. I couldn't even tell you what flags I'm looking at, but that's nice, 88 rated, not bad at all, I think I've got nearly all of the walkout goalkeepers now, which is a bit annoying, um, but yeah, that, that's not bad, um, I don't know how much he's going for, yeah, 40,000, that's not bad at all, um, we'll put Stindle up, and we'll get rid of Wembley, so yeah, that's not, that wasn't a bad pack, so we've got one walkout so far out of all these good packs, so next rare gold pack, can we get back to back, we can't, Surely boards from this. No, no boards. It's going to be a Spanish player. Don't know who, but it's not going to be a good one. Marcano, 82 rated. So not a great one there. We'll get rid of those. So two rare players packs. I think these are untradeable. I think. So no walkout from this one. It's an inform. Portuguese left mid. Who is that? Oh, is that the uh oh, what's his name? Yeah, Guerrero. So that's not too bad actually. So we've had two informed so far from all these packs. Um which isn't too bad. I mean team of the week this week isn't great, is it? But um mm, yeah, I mean this is untradeable, so it's not amazing, but it'll do. 
So we get three tradables there, which isn't too bad. Put those up onto the trade pile for later on. So the next rare players pack. So like I said, this is obviously untradeable. No walkout again. Are we getting at boards again? We are. Brazil, CDM. Oh, for a moment there I thought Fabino, but Luis Gustavo, another 83 rated to put into the club, which is uh, which is good for SBCs, obviously, for the Arnautovic SBC, where you need an 83 rated squad, I think it was. Um, so, all good for that. Oh. Okay, so we'll put him up, him up, him up. He's tradable and he is untradable, so we'll get rid of him. So how many packs? Four packs left. So we've got two mega packs and two rare mega packs. Come on. Is our luck in for these? Give me something good. So no walkout again. Not even boards from a mega pack. Come on. That's not great. Not great at all. That is a terrible pack. So these are untradeable, aren't they? I think the rare mega packs might be tradable. So let's hope we get something good at those. I mean, I'll, I'll accept good anything from anything, but I'd rather rip one of these tradable cards than an untradable one. Let's get rid of all those. Him, and we'll put Tadic up. So three packs left. Mega pack, two rare mega packs. Come on. Give me that walkout. Let's see it. No walkout. I'm just going to skip now. Not good. Ugh. These are terrible packs. We get a thousand coins, but is it really worth it? Probably not. So Tevez untradeable, Fernando's tradable. We just used him in the SBC, which is a bit strange because why is he? Did we use him? I thought we did. Maybe we've already packed him just now. Um, we get rid of Tevez as well. So last two packs, two rare mega packs. Come on, show me that walkout. Show me the walkout. Oh, come on. <laughs> Nothing seems to be in my favour at the minute with promos. So 83 rated Horn. Uh, oh, and 85 Jekko. That's not bad, actually. He's untradeable. Come on. Oh, these are tradable. <laughs> Why am I swapping around? <laughs> okay. So, yeah, we get an 85 and an 83 from that. Which isn't bad, I suppose. But it's not great, is it? Come on. Let's see that walkout from this. Come on, show me the walkout. Ugh. So, unfortunately, we didn't pack one from the packs that I had. Um, I think what I'll do is I'm going to be completing that. Uh, so, yeah, nothing from that pack at all. But I'm g oh, we get a loan pack and Jonas as well. But I'm going to be completing that on Altovich. Obviously, not in this video, but I will be completing that. So, hopefully, we can... Uh, well, we'll definitely get one of the players and then maybe from the rewards from that you never know so our loan item is gonna be who is that oh Matic okay <laughs> wow no one really cares about that but um yeah that's gonna be the end of the video so like comment and subscribe and yeah thanks for watching